Hello all, and welcome back to Kreos Gaming. I am continuing my playthrough of Morrowind as the Kajit Thief Drolin. Uh, except I'm not a thief anymore. I mean, by class I am, but I was kicked out of the Thieves Guild in this particular section of the playthrough because I killed the heads of the thieves. And Shoring Heart Heart here has now asked me to go kill Gentleman Jim Stacy as well because... Um, the Kamanatong don't like competition, and um, for that reason, I have been instructed to remove their competition. And uh, Hard Heart has promised that with the death of... Wait, I'm in the right place. I don't have to travel anywhere. With the death of the head of the Thieves Guild, um, Drolin would be made head of the Fighters Guild. And that... Uh, hard heart would retire, and I don't understand that. That 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 is, it doesn't make sense to me. Why would uh, hard heart retire after wasteworks? Am I in the right spot? Yes, lower wasteworks is the right spot. Now the question is whether I'm think it was go left. I know it's always go left, but is this the nope? No, that's the healer. Am I not in the underworks yet? I thought I was in the underworks. Yes, I am. Okay. So... This is the cloth here. You're supposed to be a bookseller. Foreign quarter tomb. Bookseller. Alright, no. I am on the wrong side. So I have to go back upstairs and around. Yeah, so I don't know why Hard Heart would give up leadership of the Fighters Guild after going through and having all of this done. Unless he's expecting that the Fighters Guild is going to come under fire from the Empire and the other guilds because this happened. And therefore um, doesn't want... What's this about? to be associated with it, which is entirely possible. Lock level unlocked, because I've already been here. All right, Mr. Stacy, do you attack me? You you don't. Have you not heard what's been going on? There's been this rogue member of the Thieves Guild running around killing people. You, you really ought to be more concerned about your well-being. There's the 10 restore health potions, which I fully expect I'm going to need. What's your story? And I'm pretty sure Crazy Legs I'm supposed to kill, too, because he mentioned his lackeys. Um, we'll see how this goes. All right. Uh, actually, to start, let's give myself full health. Switch. Sorry, gentlemen. It is fairly funny to me that my crime has been reported, though. Um, since this is the Thieves' Guild. There we go. There's Stacy. My crime is continuing to be reported. I guess it's because I'm assaulting a new person, maybe. There we go. Okay. <sighs> That's done. Heal up in case some there's some side effect. Now he has a Daedric Sword Sword. Nice. As well as some extravagant... Ooh, and a Nads Theron's key. That's a key I recovered at some point. He also has a skeleton key that only has 50 uses. That that seems weird for something called the skeleton key. Um anyway, and then Mr. Crazy Legs here has two books. Guide to Aldrun, Guide to Sadrith Mora, Guide to Vivek, and a homilies of the Blessed Almalexia. And then, huh, he, he has a lot less on him than I was expecting. And then there's this chest here that I've been kind of curious what's in it. So I'm going to use this as an opportunity to uh, fulfill my curiosity. Just, uh, yeah, which is apparently going to take a while. Um, but I did not want, it's just gold. Okay, well, I'm not going to be keeping the gold because this isn't really happening. I'm going to wake up here shortly with... Oops, apparently I'm also going to throw my sword on the ground. Wake up from this horrible nightmare where you massacred your friends. Yep, and, and it won't have happened. Um, we'll go with that. 
nothing to see here. Run back upstairs, turn this in, and may and actually I think I am gonna make this a twofer because I'm pretty sure that after this I actually have to go kill uh, the other potential. Um, oh, not claimant, but opponent for leadership of the Th thieves guild. I think they're gonna make me kill Perseus Mercius, and so. Oh, yes, you violated the law. Another 1040 gold. Surrender. Yeah, yeah, here's my gold. I accept the gold in payment. Thank you. Appreciate that. Moving on. Terrible. It's just a business transaction at this point. Yes, I killed people. Here's money. <laughs> so glad it doesn't work that way in real life. Yeah, well, usually for most people. It's not generally the way it works. I expect there are some people that is the way it works, unfortunately. Or at least that's what you'd have that's what movies would have you believe, you know. The vigilante has to avenge his sisters, daughters, mothers, you know, pick one, death because the law won't do it because the person's rich. Alright. Our time is almost upon us. What have you done about the master thief? Well, I killed him. I hear you killed the Master Thief. Great work, Drolin. Thanks for taking care of the Thieves' Guild for me. Now the only one who can threaten my position is you. You showed... Wait, what? You, you, But you said you showed promise, but a bit too much ambition. You will not be missed. Oh, You're you have kidding. to kill him. Oh, that's funny. That's hilarious. Isn't it, though? All right, well, goodbye. And goodbye for real, because I am going to... Happily kill you, because, yeah, dude, a, a backstab. I I read ahead, and I thought they were going to have me kill Perseus Mercius, not this guy. So, okay. I mean, sure. I'm certainly not complaining about the opportunity to kill him. and But it does solidify the idea that this was definitely not the right side to uh, to join in, in this instance, because... All your hard... I did wonder why he said he was going to retire. I mean, that was just a really weird concept. And apparently it's because he was lying through his teeth. Uh, okay. He has a steel warhammer of smiting and a bunch of armor. The Wraith's Wedding Dowry, a steel helm, a locked chest that when he was in here I didn't mess with... But I'm gonna I'm pretty sure I'm gonna get to kill him by going through Perseus Mercius's questline. We'll see. Uh so let's see what uh dude's reaction is here. I've just killed your ma your leader. What say you? I've seen you've risen to master, Drolin. I'm the only one who will be taking over as guild master. I won't let you take my rank in the guild. Oh, that's funny. Goodbye. I get to fight you too, and I need to heal first. Crap. You're gonna try to beat me to death with a club? Okay, that's fine. It's gonna be a bit of a slow fight, but that's not bad. Alright, you know what? You may actually succeed in beating me to death with a club. Where's... there we go. I've actually killed you before, though, so looking to see what you have in your inventory isn't all that big a deal. Um, stuff. Stuff is what you have in your inventory. Actually, a lot of stuff. Man, he's pretty well armed. Okay. Cool. All right. One last thing I want to do before I end this terrible nightmare. Let's go talk to Perseus Mercius, even though I was... Actually, what do you say? You say, what can I do for you, Master? Yes, because now I am the guild master, apparently. Um, because who else would be? Are you going to say no one else is going to be Guildmaster but me? Nope. What can I do for you, Master? All right. Cool. Uh, is training still an expense? Yes, training is still an expense. I suppose that makes sense. Goodbye. Now let's go find out how disappointed Perseus Mercius is, or if he says something about, okay. you know, now that you're the Guildmaster, here's, you know, you could do better or something like that. I fully expect to just get attacked. Not necessarily on site, but as part of the conversation. Oops. All right, travel. 
to Aldrun, please. I'd actually meant to talk to him first uh, before going after the gentleman Jim Stacy, but I forgot about it. So, no big deal. This will be intriguing or sorely disappointing if there's no response whatsoever. Um, not sure which it's going to be. If actually, other than um, the last quest where the gal didn't even acknowledge that you'd found her brother, they've been in pretty good about following up and changing things. What can I do for you, Matt? Oh, come on. Are you serious? Fighter's Guild. You're in charge of the Fighter's Guild now, Drolin. Will you be a good master? Time will tell. Okay. Guildmaster. You are the Guildmaster. I hope you will use your power and influence for the greater good of the Fighter's Guild. Well, given how deep in the pockets of the Kamana Tong they were... Yeah, the Globermall. Globermall is in the f Guild of Fighters and Vivek. Kill him and report back to me. I did. Now what do you say? Now that Lobra is dead, you must take this battle to Shoring Hardheart. Shoring is already dead? I'm glad to hear it, Drolin. You've saved the Fighter's Guild from the corruption of the Kamana Tong. As I promised, I am naming you the new Guildmaster. Congratulations, Master Drolin. I... D um... Yeah, I think that's a code issue. Somebody... I don't... I don't think that, like, really ought to be the way he responds when you've well, gone through and killed all the Fighters Guild people. But is that because you've already talked to him once about uh, Lord Bramall? Well, possibly, yes. Um, now, I had to reload that one, though, because what he does is you talk to him about Lord Bramall and he says, go kill him. You go to you go back as if you're hoping to not kill him and Lord Bramall just recognizes that you're there to kill him. So I had to reload. Okay. Um, but, I mean, maybe because I've already had other conversations with him. But still, it seems like if you go through and kill the Thieves Guild. That's a good point. You, he ought not to be like, oh, hey. And especially, he should not give you the job to go kill Loberball. And then he definitely shouldn't give you the job to go kill Hardheart Heart and then say, you know what? I make you Guildmaster as well. He acknowledged that I was a Guildmaster when I arrived. Um, so that's why I'm saying I think that's a code issue. That that doesn't seem... Like the game should have understood that something was different than what it was expecting. Uh, I guess, spoilers? <laughs> we know what our last two quests from Perseus Mercius are going to be. Um, because of that. And... Where on earth? You know what? This is this is the end of a, a side cut. So I'm just going to call this good um, and go back to uh, the real quote unquote timeline uh, where rather than um, killing all of the Thieves Guild, I continue to stay in their good graces. And rather than helping the Kamana Tong take over or I guess maintain because the Kamana Tong has been here and was here first. It's a little snag. Um, rather than working with the Kamana Tong, we will continue to oppose them for the Thieves Guild via whatever tasks Perseus Mercius has for me. Uh, right. So, thanks all. Hello all, and thanks for watching. If you enjoyed the video, please click the like button below. You can also subscribe using the channel image in the center of the video. If you are interested in more content in this video series, to the left is a link to the full playlist. Alternatively, when it is available, to the right will be a link to the next video in the series. Thanks all.